I wasn't technically allowed to be on the show. We were like dancing all of a sudden and we hear like this big scream. We never were able to like become close and actually be friends. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we have Hi. a special guest. Hey everyone, what's up? Welcome back, this is now my channel. We're well, trading channels. Yeah, should we? <laughs> um, I start posting my content. <laughs> let me see, let, let us know if you want to see Sage. I'm joining the squad. Just kidding. Just kidding. He's joining the kidding. squad, guys. Today we're gonna do secrets about Dancing with the Stars. All the tea you've ever wanted to know, we're gonna spill it all over this video. I'm really nervous. I feel like no one else has done secrets about Hopefully we don't get, stars. yeah. I feel like- We're the first. I'm like nervous, cause if we get in trouble, <laughs> Hopefully, that's not producers, good. if you're watching this, I would suggest clicking off. <laughs> yeah, click off. Should we but, start? Let's start. The first thing like we couldn't do is like talk or see each other, like yeah. at all. Like during while we were- Outside as well, too. We weren't yeah. allowed. Only, I feel like, while we were in the building, but like rarely ever. Yeah, because I think it was something like we couldn't tell each other what dances we had mm -hmm. or like even show our dances, like the songs, nothing. Mm -hmm. So literally, we would have rehearsed, like, you know, the like, group dances that we do in like the beginning of the show? Exactly. We, for would, the yeah. Show, yeah. we would literally do it and then they would like, like pull please. us away. They would just would go like, into our own yeah. separate rooms because they didn't want to sing like anything to each other to spoil that, which is very interesting. So, but yeah. That was like one of the things which was kind of odd. Yeah, it was weird because literally we couldn't like really become friends with anyone no. else. That's why like a lot of us don't really like communicate much. We, we never were able to like become close and actually be friends. Yeah. Because we were allowed to be Now that I think of it, it's so weird. Yeah. Like they literally just like pulled us away. Can and you stop filming me? <laughs> You're so annoying. Okay, so number two, a lot of the parents were very like Crazy. I don't. I don't want to say crazy, but they also Low key they would. Psycho. Oh yeah, they would overstep their boundaries. I feel like like correcting a lot of the mentors, saying no, I want my kid to do like this instead of this, like making the mentors seem like they can't do their job, which is very weird and just very rude and obnoxious. Like not gonna name any names, but one of the times one of the moms got kicked out of the building for like swearing and causing a whole scene. With that all was the other that parents. was fun. I was there. Oh my god, yeah. I was there. Yeah, there we all fun. just were watching it happen and she was just like escorted out. We were like, what is going I on know. right now? It was so bad. And then some moms would even like come up to me and be like, try and ask me questions, like trick me into saying stuff. Exactly. Like saying that me and Kenzie were like cheating and stuff. But you know. Well, it we was, weren't, but Yeah, like, we weren't. But it was just kind of psycho. The worst. Yeah. A lot of a lot of parents, yeah, they would try to get like stuff out of you, stuff that wasn't even there. So. Yeah. It was ridiculous. A lot of the parents just more wanted their kids to win. It didn't matter what they had to do. They would do anything. Literally. They and they were like, they were so them. bored. They were like, who should we go attack now? Exactly. They'd be like, move to one person. And then like, okay, we finished her. She's had enough. Let's go to her. Yeah. And then him. It was, it was insane. For secret three is I wasn't technically allowed to be on the show at first. The, when they were doing the auditions for everybody, it was like 13, right? The oldest you could be was 13. Oh, yeah. So at the time I was 15, or like 14. I literally was so close to the age. And they were like, sorry, you can't audition, all this stuff. And I was like, I was like, okay, sounds good, like whatever. I was upset. I was like, I really want to be on this show. And then they couldn't find enough people in the other audition. I don't know if you heard about there that. Were, I was in the other audition. There weren't yeah. like a lot of kids. Especially like the guys. They were like, we can't find any The only kids that were there like, made it into troop. Yeah. So me and Jake, um, which is one of the other pro dancers, we went in for like just us two. Literally just us two for an audition. We went there, we just had to do like an interview and then like a solo. And it was so scary because there was like five people watching me and there were the producers of the whole show and I was like, <laughs> I'm terrified. But yeah, pretty much I was not even allowed to be on the show. So another thing is, I'm sure if you guys watch the episodes, you'll see we had these big like mics around us. Like it was like a strap. You probably didn't like, know it was a mic. I don't even know. It was like a waist trainer It thing. was. It, it was, was ridiculous. Weird. We would get so sweaty and like it would always fall off. It was just gross like under there. It would be like all wet and disgusting. <laughs> Literally soaking wet. Like, and we would have to- let us take it off. I know, and when we had to hand it back at the end of the day, the people were like disgusted because we were dripping sweat. Yeah, literally with like their 
nail just <laughs> picking it up. It was disgusting, and a lot of people don't know. They would also get really, really hot, and they would burn us while we were dancing. <laughs> so so those things get hot, especially if you're moving around uh -huh. all over the place. They were like they overheating. Were so, they were, and it was burning us, and we are like, can we please just take them off? And they're like, no, we're not gonna be able to hear you. And it was, it was a whole mess with that. Yeah. We wanted to take them off, and we couldn't dance with them. It kept getting in the way of our partners. Like, Thing sticks out yeah. Back. Also, so like we couldn't like say a lot of stuff. like I don't know. I always felt like, like I was on camera say. at all times, mm -hmm. just because I was like hooked up to the mic, so I couldn't like you know. Well, and then also say anything. Like, was going to the bathroom. Oh my god. That sucked because I was like, do I take it off? I was like, I, I don't know. If, I don't know if they can. I forget if I did or not. I know that like, was like, I know are they gonna hear me? Kenzie like, didn't. She was like, I'm keeping you on. I don't really care. But I was like, I'm not. Like going to the bathroom with this freaking mic on. Okay, so our, I don't even know what number we're on. Our <laughs> number, whatever. <laughs> whatever. Uh, our next secret is someone fell off the stage. I don't know if you guys like saw it, but the stage was like in a star shape. It was very odd and it was like elevated. So like there was like a bit of a drop, a pit. And I think we were rehearsing once. I don't know what happened. I don't even remember who it was. Yeah. But so we were like dancing, and all of a sudden we hear like this big scream, and this kid is like on the it, ground. It was definitely, it wasn't a girl. It was a guy. It was a, yeah. I don't remember if it was like JG or RT on. I don't know who it was. Well, it was a guy though. Yeah, it's definitely a guy. But there was like mats. Like no one got hurt at all. But it was just like crazy that he actually fell off because I was like, are you blind? But like the oh stage is like right there. Hey, at least there weren't like like stuff on me. Like they yeah. had mats in case of that. But it was just like kind of crazy that he actually fell off. But. So scary, but he wasn't hurt though, which was yeah. good. Another thing is we also did two episodes a week. So what we would do is since our dances were pretty short, just like I think like a minute and 10 seconds, mm -hmm. we would learn both of those a week. And then what we would do is we would camera rehearse the two dances in that day or in that episode. Oh my God, I don't even know what I'm saying. <laughs> no, we would right. camera block the two dances so we would do like the one and then we would do the second one the day after that we do the first episode and then just the straight the day after that is when we would do the second so there are two days in a row it's not like a week break and then like the next episode yeah because we when, they were, when they were airing it it was like one a week but then okay. sometimes it was two weeks so we had to do like double the work almost like a week exactly i don't was there ever a time where we only had to do like one dance like i feel like no. that didn't happen and then for the finale it was the hardest we had to do four dances Dances in one week. Oh God, yeah. That was really difficult. Next secret. Hope you guys are enjoying <laughs> this. If you are, make sure you like, subscribe, down and below. Those post notifications. We have a professional YouTuber. Okay, so another thing was we all, I think except for you, I think yeah. you got your original partner. Well, the thing about my partner is that Kenzie was on tour at the time, and oh. so I had to. Everyone started rehearsal like two weeks earlier than I did. Oh really? Yeah. But you I can think keep same going. with me because what happened is they had partner confusion because a lot of the kids, like a lot of the stars, were charter, charter, <laughs> shorter, <laughs> shorter, <laughs> shorter. <laughs> My bad. A lot of the a lot of the stars and films were shorter than everyone expected, so they all had to switch everyone up. Like Miles was supposed to be with Riley. I was supposed to be with Trip. Like Trip Palin who got cut the first episode. I was supposed to. Be <laughs> Just had to throw that in there. Because I didn't know, I don't know if people even remember. Yeah, probably not. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just giving you guys a little, you know, like, memory in case you guys forgot. But I think in Michaela, who was one of the girls in Troop, she originally was a pro dancer and who had my partner, Jason. And then she got moved to Troop and Cami got moved from Troop to pros because of height. It was all because of height. They were like, oh my gosh. This is I think mess. everyone was like shorter than they were supposed to be. Or exactly. Something. Yeah. Like Riley could never wear heels because Miles was literally like shorter than her, yeah. so she never wore heels, which was honestly an advantage for her because you know, heels are hard yeah. to dance in. So, but I mean that was very confusing. We, I didn't start rehearsal like until I think like five I think days yeah we after started I was supposed to. Yeah, we started it late, later than everybody. When I, yeah, when I came, everyone was like, oh yeah, we just finished our third dance, and I was like, I just got here. I know. <laughs> Which was interesting. So definitely some kids got an advantage. But, you know, we all made it work and we all made it great. So I but everyone would cry in the skybox. You remember that? Oh my god. They would yeah. come up from like their scores and if they got a bad <laughs> score, <laughs> never cried. And me and oh, Ken, like I don't have know. to sit there knowing yeah. you're gonna get cut. It's so sad. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
It was really sad. Should we talk about the remotes? Ooh, go ahead. Okay, so pretty much at the end of each episode, they were like, vote for your favorite in the audience, and they gave remotes, apparently. Remotes. Mm -hmm. We don't think those remotes like actually work no. at all, but no, it pretty it much just, yeah, it just said like each person then if you like them the best you'll tap like click their button. There's a fly that's like swarming me they right want, now. They just want to be on the YouTube video. I know, it's fine. <laughs> Go follow the fly. Go follow <laughs> at fly. At fly on all platforms. Literally. Pretty much each person had like a button to press on their remote and then if whoever they liked they would click. But it just seems crazy to me mm -hmm. that that would all quickly go to the TV wherever the monitor is. God, yeah. Figure out the votes and then give it because they were like, pick the your favorite, and then they would announce it right after. I'm like, there's no way they got that yeah, information well, that and fast. And a lot of our friends would be the ones that would phone it too. And they're like, I don't think it even like did anything. Yeah, it was literally so rigged that remote part. They obviously they had the whole thing like set up. They no, they for sure did. But honestly, it's kind of crazy that there's there's actually a lot of secrets. I'm thinking about it. Yeah. No, there are. Like, we were like coming up with this, and we were like, "Oh my gosh!" Like, we actually didn't even really like think about this, but there's so many. I know. Well, that's all of our secrets. Yes. Okay. Ellie's gonna do the outro because yes. I don't like it. <laughs> okay, guys. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you like, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications so you always get notified when every stage uploads a new YouTube video. So make sure to go do it right now, and all of his social medias will be linked in the description, so go follow him for more, you know, behind the scenes and other stuff if you want to know more about Sage. And we love you guys so much. Bye! That was so good. Thank you.